It's more than I thought. Hi, you pals. Sis Katir Mary here, and welcome to the channel. Today, I'm going to be showing you my Disney Parks Ears collection. So, I've had several over the years, um, but because of Year of the Ear and swaps and making my own ears, um, I haven't kept a whole lot of the Disney Parks ears. I really love the homemade um, small shop aspect, um, and I love like what you can do different um, with a homemade pair of ears than what Disney Parks does. Now, don't get me wrong, they are really coming up with some great ideas, and there are ears that I want uh, from the parks. These are a few that I have, um, that I have held on to, that I've kept, that I've really, really loved, and um, I'm going to show them to you. I'm just going to show them to you. And if you're interested, make sure you subscribe because I am going to be going through my entire ear collection. Ears I've made, ears people have made for me. There will obviously be some Year of the Ear ears in there. And if you haven't already seen our Year of the Ear collection from 2022, I'm going to link that video up here and you can see what we were gifted in the swap last year. So let's get started. We're going to start with these ears because I'm going to put them on and wear them for the rest of the video. And it's Small World. Small World ears. If you know, um, if you watch the channel or you know, Small World is my favorite dark ride uh, in the Magic Kingdom. And these we got in Disneyland. So when we were at Disneyland in 2019, um, Michael picked these up for me. I'm super excited because I absolutely love them. I love the bow and how super adorable all the little, uh, children characters are here. There's the clock face on this side. This is my favorite part of Small World, the big clock face. And then on this side, it says, hello. And then on the back, it has the clock face. And it says goodbye. And they're super sparkly. They're made with sequins. They also have this pink sequiny headband. And the inside of the headband is like super soft and plush. And this was back when I don't, yeah, I have some with the big long tags. This was back when the tags were still like a normal length on the tag. So we're going to wear these for the rest of the video. Yay! Yay! Also, ears we picked up in Disneyland, um, and these are probably some of my favorites, even though I don't usually like gold. Um, this is some of my favorites. So, it's this silver and gold pair of ears with the castle right here in the center, and I love the bow is a little off. It's not directly in the center. It's kind of sideways. One of my favorite aspects of this pair of ears um, that it kind of sits to the side. But as you can see, it's silver sequins. It is the silver sequined headband with the goldish plush on the inside. What a great pair of ears. I love these. The back is just exactly like the front silver sequins. So Michael grabbed these for me. These are from 2020, 2019. These are not the most recent pair of gingerbread ears, but it's Mickey is a gingerbread. Love, love, love this, love this. And it's Minnie as a gingerbread. Look at her adorable little Christmas bow. Called a Christmas bow because it's green and white polka dots, but they're gingerbread and they're like, it's like a suede material. And then this piece of candy in the center, just really rounding out that Christmas vibe gingerbread vibe here and it's the the headband has that brown material with like an icing stripe on it and then the inside is the metallic red just like the piece of candy so there's those the next pair of christmas ears um wow we got these in like 2017 when we went to the festival of the holidays um in epcot we got these in epcot they are these, they're clear with, um, what is this, Christmas lights on it. The center doesn't have a bow. It has this like battery pack thing, it's Happy Holidays. And then obviously this side is the same. It's a lot of glare because they're clear, 
but they do, maybe, I think their battery is dead. Oh no, okay, the battery is dead, but they typically light up um, like four different versions of light up when you click this button right here. Um, they have like teeth on the inside so that they like grab onto your head because this is a really horrible plastic headband. These are not comfortable, not even close. Um, I think I wore them for 10 to 15 minutes in the parks when we bought them and I was like, oh my gosh, these are not cool. Um, I've kept them so that I could wear them for Vlogmas and Christmas type videos um, just because we do so many videos in December. It's nice to have several different pairs of ears to change in and out of. So these are not comfortable. I don't suggest anything like this at all. All right, next up, ears we bought in the parks. Um, we got these at Walt Disney World in July of 2020. I think that's correct. They had all the 2020 merch, all the 2020 merch, buy one, get one free or half off. So we were there with friends and um, my friend and I decided to each get a pair of these. So we both got this 2020 um, sparkle. I actually kind of like the way this is done, how it's like a, um, it's like clamped up here. And then this big, beautiful blue sequin bow. This side is exactly the same. But the band has 2020 on it, and it's the blue sparkly material. The inside is um, blue plush, navy plush. But I just love these. I love these ears. Again, back when uh, tags weren't out of control, but they're these beautiful blue 2020 ears. Next up are the ones I got from Shop Disney. We'll go with this one first. And this one, um, we're into the ridiculous tags at this point. But these both pair came from the Minnie Mouse Main Attraction Collection. So the carousel was series seven of 12 from the Minnie Mouse Main Attraction. And both of these still have their tags on them. Um, I haven't even, I never even took the tags off. So there's the tag of that. And then the ears are of Prince Charming Carousel or King Arthur Carousel, um, I, either one. I'm not sure if it was uh, Disneyland or Disney World specific, but here is the Carousel Horse. I love, love, love the color on these ears. This, this greenish teal color, look at that bow in the center. It's gorgeous. And I said I didn't like gold, but like every pair of ears I've shown you has gold in it. So apparently I do like gold. Um, I think the reason why I really loved these carousel ears and then this pattern is just really cute was because this was the July, um, the ones that came out for July and July is my birthday and then the coloring. And so I just, I wanted all the merch from this particular month. Um, they do have this outrageous tag though. Like how do you wear these? Obviously I don't wear them, but <laughs> uh, they have the beautiful teal green sequins on the side and the inside is a pink plush. But again, here are the July Carousel Minnie Mouse Main Attraction ears. And like I said, I got the Big Thunder Mountain ears as well and kept those because Big Thunder Mountain is one of my favorites. And I really loved, loved the color, the way they did this, how it just, to me, just looks like Big Thunder Mountain. So again, I kept the tag here on it and the ears. I just feel like this is 100% Big Thunder Mountain. So you have the sequiny red and pink like ombre-ish effect mountains here. This bow I think is to die for. Look how squishy that bow is. And then it says BTM, Big Thunder Mountain. And same on this side. I just really like that. And then this side is the same with the ombre-ish like mountains. I think some of the best features of these ears is the leather center on the bow and the denim uh, band, but look at that train. That is Big Thunder Mountain riding up the denim band. And then the inside is like a maroon plush. So 
September, Minnie Mouse Main Attraction, Big Thunder Mountaineers. All right, now we have like three pair left. I was able to, in 2021, pick up two pair of ears at my local Burlington Coat Factory. Thanks to Cami over at Key to Disney, who had been shopping at Burlington and kind of showing her Disney Parks merch that she got there. So these I think were like $4 at Burlington, the next two pair. So I got these purple, these lavender ears. Um, they're just purple sequins. They're kind of like the blue ones um, in the way that they're made. I really like this. It's very plush here and then like cinched together. But also I love this shimmery bow. The coloring is amazing. These are great ears. These are actually really comfortable also. And then the headband side is just like the bow. It's this purple shimmer. And then the inside is the purple, like plushy fabric. So these I got at Burlington, super pretty. The next pair I got at Burlington was actually why I even went and checked my Burlington. Um, when Cami posted her like video, she said she got these and I was like, I have been wanting these ears forever. And it is the Coral Park ears. There we go. I, I like the ears that are kind of like the same color palette from Disney sometimes. So it's the sequined coral ear with this really shiny coral bow. Very simple, but really super cute. The same side, the headband is exactly the same as the ears and the inside is just a plush. I like how they do the plush on the inside. Let me see if I can, there you go. Um, because it makes it a little softer on your head. Um, we're going to actually put these on because they're super cute. A super fun color. These are like really, I mean, I really like them. They're super comfortable. Park uh, ears didn't used to be comfortable at all. They used to be really difficult to wear. But now they're just so much better. All right, last pair. And this is a pair that Michael actually ended up hunting down for me and purchasing off of eBay because... I wanted them. I've said a million times in videos previously that my favorite Minnie is Minnie in her blue skirt with her pillbox hat. And so here are the ears. It's the blue and white polka dot sequin, nice, fluffy, squishy ears with this adorable red bow that gives off the pillbox hat vibes. And then the flower sticking out the top. I just think these are so cute and so clever. Um, they're just really, really fun. I mean, they're some of my favorite park ears that I have. I actually have worn them to the parks and I wear them in videos. Um, it has a blue shiny headband with a light blue plushie on the inside. Again, with a nice size tag, a very manageable tag. Like this is manageable. Those long tags are crazy. I don't understand why they went to it, but they did, and it's weird. So, um, but yeah, here they are, the blue skirt mini pillbox hat ears. All right, that's my Disney Parks ear collection. That's all the Disney Parks ears that I have left in my collection. Do you have these Disney Parks ears? Um, do you have some that you think I need that I don't already have? Um, what was your favorite pair? Let me know in the comments down below. So until next time, TTFN, ta-ta for now.